Sister Wives, fans explode on Christine Brown's Garrison tribute, and Christine Brown's kids honor Garrison's memory with special act. I will explain everything. Watch this video until end. Hey lovely viewers, welcome to my 2S gossip channel. Sister Wives star, Garrison Brown's passing, there have been many beautiful tributes. Without a doubt, the family is doing their best to process their grief and honor Garrison at the same time. In like fashion, Christine Brown offers a sweet tribute to Garrison as one special, first, passes without him being with them. The Browns are facing many difficult, firsts. On April 11th, Sister Wives star, Christine Brown, took a moment to reflect on Garrison Brown as the family got together without him present. While death is always followed by a series of firsts, it is difficult to face many of them. For instance, the Brown family got together for Easter and celebrated the first Easter after his passing. But some of these firsts are tougher than others. Specifically, Garrison's birthday is a special day that was dedicated to him. Undeniably, this year when his birthday came around, it was painful for the family not to have him there. However, they made tributes for their missing family member on the occasion to remember him. On Christine Brown's Instagram page, she offered a heartfelt tribute honoring Garrison Brown on his birthday. Admittedly, she said it was too hard to post on the day, but she wanted to share. She also focuses on the good times. She says, so many good times, so many memories, not enough though. While it is devastating to be without him, the family made a gesture to remember him by planting a tree. And Christine posted a quote referencing Valhalla and saying she will always miss and love him. But after posting, Christine's comments were bombarded by Sister Wives fans. When Christine Brown highlighted Garrison Brown's birthday with her tribute, Sister Wives fans erupted in the comments. Many fans were gentle and gave condolences during this hard time, but others were quick to turn the conversation to blame Cody Brown. So nice to see you included Cody. But someone else quickly disagrees. I disagree. Cody caused Garrison great grief and sadness. Who are we to judge? We only see what was on the screen. Remember that Garrison has Cody child as well, and I have. I'm sure that that's something Cody will have to live with. Until he takes his last breath. It's never easy losing a child. Narcissists don't grieve or care. Although the comments rapidly were filled with jabs at Cody Brown, others reminded that Christine Brown is grieving but attempting to find joy in sharing love about Garrison. Not the time nor the place. You're now, causing grief and sadness on this lovely memory birthday post of Christine's. Leave it alone. I thought it was an incredibly sweet and gracious thing for her too. Post as well. Some fans express concern for the remaining family. Additionally, other Sister Wives fans remind commenters that words can affect people. While Christine Brown was trying to celebrate the beautiful person Garrison was, the fans cautioned that family members left after suicide are often more susceptible to future suicides. Please be very careful because once someone commits suicide, it raises the risk for the siblings. Please be mindful of this. I don't want to scare you but it is so important that the entire family is aware of this. Sending lots of love. I hope Gabe is okay. I can't even imagine what he went through. Additionally, another person agrees. I worry about Gabe also. He has such a sweet soul. It's not a choice and very common in active grief for dopamine levels to deplete and yes the risk is absolutely higher even in a person who was mentally well person before. Although it is slightly a little over one month since Garrison. Brown's unexpected death. The family is finding ways to honor his life. Undeniably, his passing has shaken each of the Browns lives up. Christine Brown shared with Sister Wives fans a beautiful act several of the siblings took part in to remember Garrison. Christine Brown gives a sweet birthday tribute. In a touching birthday post for Garrison Brown, Christine Brown shows precious memories of his life. Undoubtedly, each photo and memory is more valuable than ever in his absence. Christine captions, Yesterday was Garrison's birthday. Gosh, it was just too hard to post. Then she gives a nod to the wonderful memories floating through her mind. She adds, so many good times, so many memories, not enough though. Without a doubt, Garrison was a unique soul that has left a huge hole in the Brown family. 
Furthermore, Christine Brown shares a quote in his remembrance. Lo there do I see the line of my people back to the beginning. Lo they do call to me. They, bid me take my place among them in the halls of Valhalla, where the brave may live forever. Hashtag always miss you hashtag love you hashtag happy birthday. Additionally, fans sent their thoughts in the comments. Hard to even comprehend this entire thing. Happy birthday to Garrison. May he feel his family's adoration from afar. Including Cody in this tribute to Garrison, you're a class act all the way, Christine. Although Christine Brown adds several photos on Instagram from memory lane, she also shows an act the family performed on his birthday to show their love. Within the photos, Christine Brown includes a new memory they are making on behalf of Garrison. In his honor, the siblings are taking time to plant a tree. Several of Christine and Cody Brown's children were in the pictures. Isabel, Peden, and Truly were together to commemorate Garrison's birthday with Christine. Following, Sister Wives fans added comments about the sweet sentiment of adding plant life to carry on in his absence. I love that you planted Garrison a tree. I think he would have liked that. I love 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 you guys planted something in his memory. This is beautiful post, Christine happy birthday to Garrison. Weeping snow fountain willow tree I just saved this tree it should blossom and is beautiful. Sister Wives season 19 is currently filming and will reportedly head in a dark direction, according to insiders. Season 19 was initially anticipated to follow. The families lives following the triple divorce. Christine Brown and David Woolley are now happily married, while Janelle and Mary are exploring life as single women. However, fans know that the family was forever changed when Garrison Brown took his own life at the beginning of March. Many Sister Wives viewers thought TLC might cancel the show, or at the very least switch directions in the wake of his passing. As it turns out, the show will indeed continue and is expected to cover Garrison's passing. Many Sister Wives fans were shocked to hear that season 19 would continue filming. TLC often does enjoy documenting family tragedies, as they did with the death of Tammy Slayton's husband. However, the nature of Garrison Brown's death was incredibly tragic and jarring. It's going to be darker because they're going to try to work through, why did this happen? A source close to the Brown family reportedly told The Sun. How could this have possibly happened? When Janelle and her children are such a strong family. They're going to start breaking each other down a bit to figure out where the mistake happened, the insider went on to say. Something went wrong somewhere, so it's like, what went wrong? So, they're going to dive into the problems of the family and how to fix them moving forward. The insider also shared the family is spending a lot of time blaming one another, much the way Cody did when his wives left. Without a doubt, it's going to be a very difficult season for viewers at home to see. Garrison Brown's friends want the show cancelled. Sister Wives may be a major moneymaker for the Brown family, but Garrison's closest friends want the show to end. And it's entirely likely that many of his surviving siblings do as well. Leon and Logan Brown haven't appeared on the show in years. In light of Garrison's death, it's likely that other siblings won't film any longer. Last season, the show heavily covered Garrison and Gabe's estranged relationship with their father. Without a doubt, that had to weigh heavily on the boys' mental health. Lately, Sister Wives fans are picking up on Tony Padron bashing his mother-in-law, Christine Brown. While most were tolerant for a time, they are now starting to get sick and tired of the way he talks about her. McKelty and Tony Padron capitalize on their opinions. Although the entire Brown family is going through a tough time right now with the loss of Garrison Brown, McKelty Brown and her husband, Tony Padron are expressing their grief with complaints. Both McKelty and Tony have continued to be vocal on their Patreon account about disliking how Garrison's funeral was handled. Currently, this is an area of contention, but both McKelty and Tony are quick to blast their opinions. Furthermore, the couple is quick to share their thoughts no matter who it affects because it is proving to be a good money maker for them. While no one is off limits, Christine Brown is often getting the brunt end of Tony's slamming statements. On Reddit, some Sister Wives fans are noticing the frequency of Tony Padron's pattern of criticizing Christine Brown. Furthermore, one user says, is anyone else noticing how hard Tony has been going in on Christine? 
It's almost disrespectful to me. Seems like he keeps giving Cody and Robin unlimited grace but Christine gets the criticism. Was he always this way and I didn't. Catch it. Undeniably, there have been tensions from the beginning since Christine wasn't immediately excited when McKelty Brown told her that she and Tony were planning marriage after a short dating period. In many ways, her concern was based on not knowing Tony well enough for such a quick marriage. Fans see the developing trend. Although there has always been a little animosity between Tony Padron and Christine Brown, it just keeps getting more intense. After the initial Reddit question, post, several other fans weigh in on the relationship between Tony and Christine. He's still salty she didn't immediately welcome him into the family and realizes her love is unconditional but Cody and Robbins isn't. OMG yes. I was going to comment this today too. I know he has beef from when they first met but lately it's been a bit too much. I feel like something must have happened recently. I think so too. Where's this energy coming from? Other fans notice that McKelty. Brown talks disrespectfully to Christine Brown as well. Seemingly, Tony Padron's stance is fueled by his wife's trend of disregard for her mom. McKelty is disrespectful to her mom sometimes. Another response, I feel like this is how, where Tony is getting it from. If his wife is disrespectful to his mill then he will too. Ju imagine how their kids will act. McKelty talks to her mom in a similar way. He's parroting her and being her crony, it seems like to me. And nobody, corrects either one of them. I'd drag my sill or bill straight to hell if they spoke to our mother with disrespect. However, some point out Christine Brown isn't their only target. Saying, Tony is odd for sure, but McKelty is a total moron. And incredibly rude to everyone it seems. McKelty talks to Christine the way Cody talked to Chistine, always with an undertone of mocking or disrespect, even when lovingly, joking. Thanks for watching this video. What do you think about this? Video told on comment box and subscribe your channel.